Welcome, this is the energy vibration reading for the sun, the Cancer Sun, Moon, and Rising. It is the week of July 4th, and that is a celebration in America, but it's also the celebration of my two years on YouTube. I want to thank you, Cancer, so much. Thank you um, for the wonderful support that you have been given to me, and this is just so wonderful. This is brilliant. Um, on 4th of July I'm going to do for a special presentation a Q&A and this is going to help you to bring forth wonderful new energies and um, you can connect with me there's gonna be questions and answers and all that sort of a thing so if you would like uh, um, please like share these videos listen to your Sun Moon and Rising sign listen to your um, month reading if you haven't done that listen to the general readings because there's also other information this week is going to be a week of um, um, uh, especially the weekend is going to be a spiritual weekend it's um, completion and completion with a situation with a Queen of Pentacles and it can for some people to quit the completion of something with the Queen of Pentacles, but yet the Queen of Pentacles is balancing off some um, situation. So some people will be having a completion um, of the Queen of Pentacles, but some people will be balancing off certain aspect with the Queen of Pentacles. So this is going to be good. What is happening for you, water sign? Because you are Cancer, you're vibrating in your own energy vibration. This is actually a wonderful week for you guys because you have the Eight of Pentacles on Monday. Eight of Pentacles is wonderful. It has been coming up. So a lot of people have been working on wonderful situations because this is the week of fortune. So a lot of fortune. This is happening for especially the men between the ages of 18 and 35. So just working hard and bringing financial abundance is one of a positive energy in your life. We have also a lot of love and we have the energy of the hermit or energy of the hermit is a spirit world calling out to you connecting with your guides and angels which is extremely good and extremely positive as we look forward we have the energy of another three and this is the three of um the three of ones the three of ones is a lot of new beginnings people are leaving certain aspects behind people are moving on people want to change certain aspects and change certain things in their life and this is good we have the energy vibration of the six of Pentacles which gifts are coming in so you're balancing out your financial situation you're getting you're receiving um, gifts of money coming in and you're balancing out your financial situation so this is going to be good whatever that was happening with a queen of swords she no longer has an effect on you so whoever had because last week she came up and she was coming after you well whatever is happening you have no more you're celebrating her um, ending whoever this queen of sword was and she was um, coming at you you're celebrating her ending but this queen of sword has been affecting you this is a Leo uh, um, you no know, this is a, a Libran person, Libran or Aquarius. Whoever this Libran or Aquarius was that was having an effect on you. And it can also be, but I'm getting more of a Libran and Aquarius. It can also be the Gemini, but it's a Libran and Aquarius that was coming after you. The Gemini women are not that, you know, so it's coming like with a sword. They're more, they're more intuitive. The, they're more like the fox. They're sly as the fox. So you know but this is more the energy of an Aquarius of a Libra that was coming at you and you are victoriously successful over her so the number three is going to be your energy also another one to sign has the energy of the number three also as we look at the weekend we have a four of ones a completion to a situation finally a situation as completed and this situation can have to do with the energy of uh, um, the Taurus is the, the Virgos or the is Capricorn people okay so a completion of the situation with either Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person this is really a sense of a real completion whatever that has been happening and Sunday is wonderful this is the second time I've seen the Queen of Pentacles coming up because on Sunday the moon is the full moon in car in Capricorn and this is good this is a wonderful day to make you your wishes on this full moon so that they can arrive in the next full moon so this is good whenever 
the um, Queen of Pentacles comes up because the full moon is in Capricorns and she comes up on the day of the full moon she is going to guide you and show you inner wisdom and this is good but also show you how you can manifest things around you and Thursday you know is a wonderful day because money seems to be the message you have money on Monday the eight of Pentacles on Thursday you have the six of Pentacles and you have the Queen of Pentacles so this is actually a wonderful week for you cancers no matter how you look at it you have a lot to inner wisdom is what you need to look at this week inner wisdom inner wisdom is the game of the week you need to find inner wisdom within you need to connect with the energy of inner wisdom you need to understand and realize that this queen of swords has no more effect on you she has rain or gain and she is out now she cannot survive whatever is happening because you're having a triumphant success over her so whoever um, the screen of sword was for you cancer people you are getting rid of them and you have gotten rid of them because a completion come right behind there she's in the reverse form and a completion comes right behind there so this is saying to you that whoever that that Queens of swords I'm seeing an Aquarius and uh, a Libran person whoever that person was they have no more effect on you okay and this can be affecting the men and the women okay whoever the screen of sword is she is not affecting your life in any way because the screen the screen of sword last week in last week reading go back and listen to last week reading she was gonna come at you you were going to have to pay her some money or something like that but somehow you have find something to keep her off at bay and you're celebrating your win and victory over her which is extremely good the completion is wonderful because the completion is bringing in the energy of uh, the eye princess and the energy of the eye princess is your intuition is opening you have completed something and what is so beautiful about this the hermit and the eye princess coming up in the first aspect of your week is actually saying to you you know I'm showing you the way to make money I'm showing you how to work on things I know you can do it and I'm awakening your inner wisdom find that inner wisdom within you so you can make more extra money to come in your life and this has also to do with the men because the men is as if you guys are opening up certain aspects and these are the men between the ages of 18 and 35 and you started to work in so much aspect but you're working from your inner wisdom from the self from your inner wisdom you're trying to bring in stuff so this is going to be good so number three is your number as we look at love love on Tuesday is wonderful and people are loving now from a place of honesty and this is good on Friday a wonderful connection a celebration a victory over getting rid of some um, hair sign people that were affecting you in your life that you connected with in whatever way and they were creating cover so you have uh, and you're going to overwin and win the situation that is happening so this is really good so love is going to show up on the aspect of Tuesday and Friday and this is good so Friday even uh, some people will be connecting with each other to go out and make a wonderful wonderful celebration of something as we go forward we're using the energy of the vortex and the energy of the vortex what is coming in oops I'm sure I can replace fall premises with um, the law base premises and this is good I've seen this before and it says uh, there has been a team unfolding here of replacing false premises uh, with the law base premises and we would like to leave you with a final one we all make too much of us 
all in a simple completion of all that is not. Be easy about it. Be kind to yourself. Do things that make you feel good. Look for things that brings you um, reliable things, you know, where all things that you can have and receive. So this is really positive. This is really a positive, positive energy. This is something that you can count on. This is something that you are aware of. This is something that you can believe in. This is something that you need to be aware of. So be aware of this sort of energy that is coming in. We're using the energy of the abundancy and what you came up with in the middle of summer the winter card but it is wonderful it says Psst. it's me again the universe you deserve more you know much more try this stop trying to predict and therefore limit what is going to come just know it's is going to come and let me figure out the rest <laughs> This is so wonderful. This is really wonderful. This is a message from the universe that is saying, you know, just know that good things are coming and let they figure out how it's going to be manifested in your life. But they know and see and hear what you have asked for and they all want you to be happy. So just don't worry. Don't worry about what is happening. It's going to um, be okay. All right. This is wonderful. This is extremely wonderful. It is, it is, it's so good. Um, on Wednesday, there is going to be a lot of information coming in to show you a way further in your life which is extremely good it's going to also bring a little success but this success is not huge success it's just a little success of um, um, receiving money gifts that sort of a thing little it's you know every little add up to something and it's good hmm, this is good this is wonderful this is wonderful experience that is going on so this is um, profound and wonderful so I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back you Kansas and please like and share these videos uh, and you know celebrate on Friday whatever is happening on Friday celebrate it's going to be wonderful um, Tuesday for the people who are celebrating Independence Day it's going to be a day of um, love love is here so this is a positive and I'm saying namaste until next week